What are you saying to me? Is that I would have been right to have stayed and spoken in favor of policies coming out of Europe, destroying NATO, massive nationalization, destruction of any private education, any private health service, moving towards a semi-East European state. That would have been all right within the tabernacle of the Labour Party. I mean, I'll be blunt with you, Roy. You talk about cancer. I feel very strongly about people whose entire life depends on the working class movement. Your father was a miner. He was in jail in the general strike. You got into Parliament as a Labour member. Every office you held was because of the Labour Party. Cabinet Minister, appointed by a Labour Prime Minister, and then you left the party. Now, that's a cancerous growth. Not personally, but I think people who betray those who gave them power are the real threat. And I must say that bluntly to you, because I think that's the real Now, having said that... You think you're promising us Derek Hatton being leader of the Labour I'm not. I'm only saying, Roy, I'm only saying, Roy, that the people that stay true to those who put them in power, these are the people I admire, not the people who climb into power on the backs of others, kick away the ladder, and are presented by everybody as men of principle and moderate.